How about some early 20th post-war poetry? This is a poem written by T.S. Eliot in five cantos. It's called The Wasteland. Please enjoy. The Burial of the Dead. April is the cruelest month. Breeding lilacs out of the dead land, mixing memory and desire, stirring dull roots with spring rain. Winter kept us warm, covering earth in forgetful snow, feeding a little life with dry tubers. Summer surprised us, coming over the Stangbergese with a shower of rain. We stopped in the colonnade and went on in sunlight into the hop garden and drank coffee and talked for an hour. We got kind of Russian Shamas Litan et Deutsch. And when we were children, staying at the Archdukes, my cousins, he took me out on a sled and I was frightened. He said, Murray, Murray, hold on tight. And down we went. In the mountains, there you feel free. I read much of the night and go south in the winter. What are the roots that clutch? What branches grow out of this stony rubbish? Son of man, you cannot say or guess, for you know only a heap of broken images where the sun beats and the dead tree gives no shelter, the cricket no relief. And the dry stone, no sound of water, only there is shadow under this red rock. Come in under the shadow of this red rock and I will show you something different from either your shadow at morning striding behind you or your shadow at evening rising to meet you. I will show you fear in a handful of dust. Frisch weht der Wind, der Heimat zu, mein Irish Kind, wo weinest du? You gave me hyacinths for us a year ago. They called me the hyacinth girl. Yet, when we came back late from the hyacinth garden, your arms full and your hair wet, I could not speak and my eyes failed. I was neither living nor dead and I knew nothing. Looking into the heart of light, the silence, Ud und Lea, Das Mir. Madame Sesostris, famous clairvoyant, had a bad cold, nevertheless is known to be the wisest woman in Europe with a wicked pack of cards. Here, said she, is your card, the drowned Phoenician sailor. Those are pearls that were his eyes. Look. Here is Belladonna, the lady of the rocks, the lady of situations. Here is the man with three staves, and here the wheel, and here is the one-eyed merchant. And this card, which is blank, is something he carries on his back, which I am forbidden to see. I do not find the hanged man. Fear death by water. I see crowds of people walking around in a ring. Thank you. If you see dear Mrs. Equitone, tell her I bring the horoscope myself. One must be so careful these days. Unreal city! Under the brown fog of a winter dawn, a crowd flowed over London Bridge. So many. I had not thought death had undone so many. Sighs, short and infrequent, were exhaled. And each man fixed his eyes before his feet, flowed up the hill and down King William Street to where St. Mary Woolmouth kept the hours with a dead sound on the final stroke of nine. There I saw one I knew and stopped him crying. Stetson, you who were with me in the ships at my lee, that corpse you planted last year in your garden, has it begun to sprout? Will it bloom this year? Or has the sudden frost disturbed its bed? Oh, keep the dog far hence, that friend to man, or with his nails, he'll dig it up again. You, hypocrite lecteur, mon son blague, mon frère. Thank you, good night.